Hey guys, Amp here bringing you another Affinity Photo tutorial, and in this tutorial we'll be going over how to work in multiple color formats. So originally when you open up Affinity Photo, the default is to have it in a RGB color format. So what you can do is come up to Document, Color Format, and right now it's in RGB. You can switch it to 16-bit RGB and it's still the same. But we are going to see what happens when you work with LAB or LAB. So you don't want to switch it right away. So when you have it, you can keep it on RGB, right? And a cool feature about Affinity Photo is if you come up to Layer, New Adjustment Layer, and Curves Adjustment, this little panel comes up and shows you the levels. And if you come down here and switch it to Lab, you can come and adjust it in the Lab format whilst in your RGB color format. So you can have it as this while working still in your document in the RGB color format. So if I didn't want to do that and I wanted to work in the lab format, another way to do this is to come up to document, come to color format, switch to lab, then come to layer, new adjustment layer, and you can come down to the channel mixer adjustment. And then if you wanted, you can come up to RGB and individually change between the various RGB formats. So obviously red, green, blue, and you can even go to alpha if you want, but you can even adjust in there how you want it to look. And you are still working in an lab color format for the document. So this way you can work with multiple different color formats in one singular document. Now this allows you to change how color works because the way uh, certain color formats work is the way it will play with the color. So RGB is obviously red, green, and blue, and each color format has its own way of playing with the color. And the best way to go about it is to kind of just play around and see what you kind of look for. So in this piece, you kind of want like a dull, drab kind of day. It's middle of winter, kind of sad looking. But um, you can play around with all of these different color formats and how you want it to look. Uh, it really is up to you. It's really cool that you can work in multiple color formats. Uh, I prefer just to keep my document in RGB, just because that's the way it works best, but uh, that's what I use. And um, just a heads up, when you do come to the layer format, and say you chose curves and you're in lab, right? And you make your color adjustment or whatever, this little thing. But if you switch back to RB RGB, it will change the color format back. It will reset everything. So just to keep that in mind, but that is this Affinity Photo tutorial. If you like this tutorial, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more Affinity Photo tutorials.